Every year, more than 65,000 Americans suffer sudden hearing loss, which can actually happen in a matter of hours for some people or a course of several days. In today's HealthCast, though, we're going to look at how hyperbaric oxygen therapy can really help some of these patients get better. David Irizarry has been playing the guitar since he was 12. The thought of not being able to hear the sounds he loves never crossed his mind until one day at work when he started having problems with his left ear. It just felt like it was clogged. I couldn't hear anything. So went home, took some uh, uh, decongestants, said, oh, I must be, you know, just have a clogged ear. Called it a day, said, I'll, I'll, you know, nothing to worry about. The following day, David realized something was clearly wrong was in a meeting, so picture it sitting at a, a boardroom style table, having a meeting and I can't hear out of one side of my head. I couldn't even tell who in the room was talking to me. David promptly got to see a specialist who recommended hyperbaric oxygen therapy, which is approved for sudden hearing loss. It, it gets oxygen to the organ there and it promotes the um, oxygen exchange and allows the hearing to come back. Judy Newman, director of the HCA Florida Wound Healing Center, says the sooner the process begins, the better the outcome. And when you change someone's quality of life that they leave here hearing and you see the proof on the on the, the test, oh my God, it's just like you could see the difference. The doctor circled like, like what an improvement. David underwent 21 sessions, which start to finish took a total of two hours each. While it is a big commitment, David says it was time well spent. The moment that I knew it was getting better was when the doctor took the uh, tuning fork, held it up to, my, up to my bad ear, and I could actually hear it, which the first time they did that simple test, there was, it was like nothing was there. So it's like I, I, I was told my eyes lit up when that happened because it's all of a sudden I'm hearing again. hear his own music again. And it's not always clear exactly what causes sudden hearing loss. And while it can occur really at any age, it most often affects adults in their late 40s and their early 50s.